Hello and thank you so much for purchasing my real estate CRM. This will help you to track your customers that you are speaking with and help you to guide your steps along the way so that you know who you need to follow up with. So this is your dashboard. This will show you the total number of customers that you have, the total number of clients that have won, uh, the total actual sales that you've made on homes or properties, the total commission that you've received, uh, this here is a to-do list for you, so you can make notes as needed. Uh, this will show you the items of clients or customers that need um, contact and which one is high or low priority. This is your percent of leads per source, so if you've found your clients through phone, flyers, Facebook, networking, referrals, or website, this will show you. And this will show you the quantity of leads per status, whether or not they're in negotiation, needing a follow-up if they're pending, if you're trying to contact them, you're waiting for a response back from them, if they're going to see the properties, if there's any showings, um, if they're lost or not contacted. Uh, this is your customer base list here. Uh, row column B is just the number of the client. This is your client's name, phone, email, address, the property address that they're either selling or interested in, uh, whether or not it's residential, commercial, the home size and square feet, uh, the number of bedrooms, baths, the lot size and acreage, number of stories, the location, the school district. And this is your first contact. So this is the first date that you've reached out. This is the last date that you've contacted them. Uh, priority status and the source, how you found them. Uh, the status, so say we are needing, uh, they wanna go see properties or homes, and uh, so this is in the showing status, if they're in uh, negotiations or pending close, or if it's one. So these are um, little to-do lists. If you need to do things, uh, you can mark this done, or to-do, if you need to send thank you gifts or call people. Um, that sort of thing. This is where to put the notes. Uh, your closing date, you can um, double click in there and, and pick a date. So this is more on your end of um, closing. So say we have a closing date of the 18th. You can close, choose that there. The list price, so say we've got the list price for $455,000. Um, and then it's sold for four fifty thousand. Um, if your commission rate is five percent, it's going to automatically um, multiply your sold price by your commission to give you the total amount of commission, and then um, and then your commission earned once it is on. So I will do this here. So if we have a list price of two fifty thousand, that'll show you the amount of commission once it's actually sold you'll put the price of the, the sold price there. Then it'll calculate your commission earned for you. And then that is the total amount of commission that you've earned for the year. Uh, this is the total amount of sales that you've had for the year. And then you can check off whether or not you've been paid or not. So that's it. If you have any questions, feel free to give me a shout.